Now I'm not sure if it's just because it was my clip, my creation, but it proper got my heart like boom, 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 yes! Hello and welcome back to Bug Realms. On this channel we like to discuss all things creepy crawly. So if that's something that interests you, please consider subscribing to the channel. So if you have been following my channel, you'll know that I did a video based on a Panthropetus Mashala feed, which would have been my round three clip for the Fatal Fangs Tarantula feeding tournament. Round four would have shown the D, Diamantinensis. Just an enclosure up here. I'll bring it down for you in a moment. Now, I was trying to think of what else I could add to this video because it is the only of, only spider of that genus that I actually currently own. So it's not like the panther one where I could show you others. But something did happen. The DD Amantinensis has molted. So I'm not sure if it's going to be hidden away now. But I'll just pop a picture on the screen over here. Now this picture has not been popped or had any kind of colour changes. It was just my phone with a flash on. That is it. They are striking blues, right? Proper striking blues from the underside. I was so thrilled. So I think what we're gonna do though, guys, is I'm gonna see if I can find the malt because it's in there somewhere. It hasn't kicked it out yet. And we'll see if maybe we can sex it perhaps for this video. I don't know if that's gonna be possible because this pain in the bum chews them up. But uh, yeah, let's do it. Hmm. Definitely not out right now. Where is that? I can see that. I can see the malt. Right. Let's try and get this out of there. Okay. So there's an old red runner here. We're just going to take that out. We don't. You don't need to be in there. Can't feed this one because uh, freshly molted tarantula hasn't hardened its fangs yet. And you might have been able to see in that photo that the fangs were not dark enough for it to be feeding. Now the malt is in here but I also believe the spider is and I don't want to spook her I just want the malt it's coming oh stuck on the web oh no I'm gonna break it up okay I got it oh no luckily it's the abdomen piece that we need um, to sex this spider. So uh, I'm hoping that that bit is still intact. Oh, look at this web. Okay, so here I have a little pot of soapy water. I just find that easier. I sometimes don't bother with the soap, but I do fail a bunch of mulch that's potentially because I haven't added that. So I'm gonna break off some of the leg parts that are in the way. In fact, I don't need any of that front part. Um, that's still attached. So we're just gonna push that in and I'm gonna let that soak. Look at this, I've got spider hanging off me. Or spider molt. Righty ho then, time has passed. Now, Let's see if I can work out what this is. I've got a feeling I've sexed this as a female when it was a baby, but I don't remember. I should have made a record of it, really. Okay, so I'm not doing any fancy camera work here, guys. I'm just having a look, really, for myself, and I'll show you if there's anything very, very visible. Oh, right. This is the part I hate is trying to open up the abdomen, but I've done it. Right, I'm gonna have a little nosy myself because I've got terrible eyesight, and I'll let you guys know what I see. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we have a lady. Now, 
this light is very strong so I think it's just going to put backlash on the camera uh, there are two little lines coming up from that little slit uh, let me try and get you a better a better angle than this and I'll show you exactly what I mean but we're going to put on the macro lens and let's have a look here then so you want to look just above this little flap here and there's two little prongs sticking out I can't see it on my camera right now but I'm hoping on the editing process you can make it out two little darkened prongs see can you see that now I can see it one's a bit taller than the other like two little trees coming out either side of that flap that is a sign of a female so happy happy days now I can jot it down and actually remember this time yes we have a female DD amantiensis or mountainensis I would say that one a little bit wrong beautiful spider but you wait until you see the clip that I did for this one my god right replay it okay as well please do me that favor watch it and replay it because if you miss that exact moment you'll know what I'm talking about the clip will not be that good there is just one perfection of moment where it works perfectly with the music in fact it's almost trickery it's like the music changes and you're like but nothing's happened and then boom there it is in perfect timing with the beat like oh, that's all I'm gonna say just please watch this video So there it is, I loved it, I loved it, I loved it. In fact, I'm gonna replay again, not the whole video, just that bit I'm talking about. So the music, it changes, but nothing changes with the animal, and then that boom, and the ripping of the web. It was like, I can't, just like, like that, ah, and then poof, out it comes. I have never, never caught that on camera before. Let's just roll that bit again. No! Now, I don't know, if that's just me tooting my own horn here but that particular part had my heart going creating that video I would have loved to show that in round four it would have been epic right what an amazing spider what an amazing part of a clip I just why blew me away and again I know I shouldn't be like complimenting my own work like that but damn I'm good sometimes uh, <laughs> so yeah that's all that's going to be from today's video we've got happy news of a lady and you got to witness what would have been my fatal fangs round four clip so we're going to leave it there um, stay tuned till next week and I'll show you what would have been my round five and I'll come up with something for a video for that one too take care everybody bye bye